Hello and welcome, this is Rufamonger, and I got some news for you on the Sindel front, and that is what you're seeing in front of you, that Ed Boon has very recently posted on Twitter the first look of what Sindel looks like in Mortal Kombat 11. Now, as you can see, this is Revenant Sindel, so just like Mortal Kombat X, uh, there is no previews as of this time of what her living quote-unquote skins might be. But yeah, uh, we have a very kind of imperial-ish slash dominatrixy still look here. Um, here's the picture brightened up so you can see it a little better. So a lot of the signature Sindel look is here. We got the big pomp of hair. Head, hair's a very big deal for Sindel if you're not aware. Uh, we kind of got the sexy warlock grandma look going on here. And overall it looks pretty cool as far as I'm concerned anyways. Now, once again, this is the Revenant look. I don't know if it's going to be the base default look. Uh, there will obviously be more skins than just this, and I'm I can pretty much guarantee you there will be a living Sindel as well, and that will probably come with a whole different outfit. But yeah, so as we currently know it, uh, with what's given to us, this is the current look for Sindel, and I think, honestly, I think it looks fantastic. Now, besides Sindel, we also have this teaser here of Nightwolf that was posted a little bit ago. So just in case you never saw it, uh, definitely has to be Nightwolf. The person he's facing off against, almost certainly Shang Tsung, although I guess I can't say for sure. But yeah, I don't think anyone else is going to be wielding an axe besides Nightwolf. And now I guess the big question is for DLC, who is next? Uh, we do have a render here for Sindel. We got the teaser for Nightwolf. So obviously the models are either done full up or at least, you know, very close to done, very close to what they want for a release. And who's coming first? So if we have the schedule that we've had before, one of these two characters should release right before EVO. Now, they won't be legal for EVO, just like uh, Shang Tsung was sadly not legal for CEO tournament, uh, due to the fact the NRS Pro Tour requirements need a character to be out for 30 days, which is, it's whatever, I suppose. Uh, I don't make the rules on that one, but... Uh, Will they keep the schedule here one a month going onwards? Uh, that is a bit of speculation on my behalf. Uh, one a month is a very good schedule and keeps the hype going. Uh, keeps people very interested, so I would like if they do that. I think it would be pretty good if they did that, but I guess we don't know for sure at the moment. Now, as for which of the two of these characters is first, I guess I would have to give the edge to Nightwolf, uh, simply because Nightwolf was shown off first, uh, but that doesn't really mean anything in the end, I guess, because it could just as easily be Sindel since we have the render. Uh, but yeah, so hopefully now that we're seeing some of these renders, the next DLC will be in the realm of soon-ish. Um, and look forward to more news and coverage when the characters come with you know, combos, tips, and all that kind of stuff. But yeah, so I just want to let you know how Sindel looks. I think she looks fantastic. Super hyped for Nightwolf. These are actually characters I was not expecting originally before the leaks and all that happened. And these are actually two of my favorite characters in Mortal Kombat, so I'm super freaking stoked i can't really say much more than that i am super stoked for these characters and i cannot wait for more anyways i just want to let you guys know what's going on so that is it for this video so thank you very much for watching hope this video has found you well go and play some mortal kombat